The Ghost Storm technology has been fully researched, Pathfinder. Excellent. We're ready to make our push on Meridian, then. I'll call a meeting immediately. Vidcon channels are ready, Pathfinder. The Nexus leaders think our search for Meridian is a waste of time, but we know they're wrong. Turning on vaults won't be enough without the heart of the system. Just to clarify, you're defying a direct order? No, not me. We. We are going to defy them. Ha <laughs> ha, that's the spirit. And the kit? That's where the Ghost Storm technology comes in. Isn't that right, Hager? Exactly. Our forged signals should divert some cat from you. It won't be all of them, but it'll be enough. The Tempest is small and fast. I don't need a big window. We'll drop you off and make our exit before the cat catch on. Once we're on Meridian, it'll be a small team. Move fast, figure out its secrets. Right behind enemy lines. Good time to assess their numbers, defenses. And when you're ready, we'll extract you the same way we got you in. If we come back with actuals on Meridian, the Nexus will sit up. Sounds like a solid plan, team. Hager, you ready? Good to go on your word, Pathfinder. All right, guys, this is it. Let's get moving. Are you still trying to figure out how to eat Helios? If the Archon's information is right, this is the system. Meridian should be here somewhere. On approach. Trajectory looks good. That's it. That's Meridian. Or Kitasira, as the cat call it. Looks like a giant space station. On my mark. Three, two, go. Enemy signature detected. Commence pursuit. Hager, it's working. Reading a bunch of cat headed our way. Pulling back. It's all on you now, Tempest. We should get them as close as possible to here. Intense readings could be some kind of control center. No decent landing sites. This could get messy. How messy? Ryder, looks like a flyby is our only option. I'll get as low as possible, but you'll have to eject over the target area. This is our one shot. We have to take the risk. You've fallen out of things before, right? Just don't scream too loud on the way down. It's embarrassing. All right, you know the drill. Watch your rate of descent. Shield should take care of the rest. So far, so good. The cat haven't detected us. But once we go in, we'll be clear as day to any troops on the ground. Don't worry about us. Just make sure you and the Tempest get out safe. Loud and clear.
We'll need to survey the area, figure out what we're dealing with. I am detecting active conduits nearby. Your scanner should be picking them up. The Kate have spent a lot of effort here. Maybe the Archon's cracking the whip. Pathfinder, while interacting with that console, I detected the presence of a complex network, connected via a central command hub. A hub? You mean we found Meridian's controls? Most likely. However, the hub is dark. Deactivated. Let's see what Meridian's all about. We can start by finding its central hub. Pathfinder, we are looking at the central command hub I detected earlier. As with the monoliths and vaults, the hub is connected to the two neighboring towers. So, activating the towers will also activate the command hub. Change in plan? I say we activate Meridian. Now! And the cat? Activating a vault has previously activated a purification field. Perhaps Meridian is similar. Let's head to those towers and see what we can find. Pathfinder, interfacing with that console has activated a gravity well. I'm picking up radio interference, a cat signal. Alert! The detected signal was a decoy. Key to zero has been infiltrated. All units are to focus on incapacitation and capture of the Pathfinder. Better be ready. Sounds like trouble up ahead. Check out those other two towers first.
Sam, what do you think? Intense vortexes of scourge energy. I would steer clear if I were you, Pathfinder. I wonder if there's a broken Atmo processor somewhere that's causing this downpour. I'm just glad it's rain and not, for example, a corrosive acid fog. They can't have really made themselves at home here. It's like a damn forest in here. How are they growing? Hostile shuttle incoming. the other towers to get in here. for one district. She's off the charts here. Pathfinder, it appears the energy waves from these craters contributed to the scourge throughout Helios. So whatever happened here caused the scourge to erupt all across the cluster? Yes, Pathfinder. How? Did the remnant builders trigger the scourge? Or maybe they were attacked. That's... I don't even get these readings.
surprised the kid haven't taken this place apart trying to discover its secrets. We have found remnant materials to be quite resistant to a normal weaponry. That's probably why. I'm kicking myself for not bringing breadcrumbs. Are you hungry? I have some rations. No. All this tech? This was something big. Detecting low levels of power, Pathfinder. A scan may help identify conduit. I see the conduits. Some kind of pattern here. That's fried. Will it even work? You're the expert. Damage to parts of the system are preventing power out. Can we reroute past the damage? That may work, Pathfinder. Boosting trace signals. Provisional repairs are complete, Pathfinder. Only one way to know for sure. Translating. Flight control systems online. Welcome, Administrator. I don't like this. We should get out of here. Restoring the systems appears to have reactivated something else nearby. I can see that, Sam, and I don't think it's good. Translating. Exploration vessels on standby. We have seen remnant ships, but none in working condition. It says it cannot retrieve commands from the Meridian engine. Hmm. Meridian engine? Sam, do you know what? They're going to be trouble. Watch out! The remnant have woken up. Writer, I just take a surge of energy on the scan. The section you're in lit up like Mardi Gras. What's it? Mardi Gras? What's going on? Are you all... Can't talk right now!
are probably waiting out there for us. So stay alert. Got it. Tower done. We'll need the other one to access the command hub. like a remnant console we could use. Come on, really?
gotta be getting close to one of those towers. We need to activate both to reach Meridian's core. I detect working remnant technology. We could turn that against them. Shrooms. Really big ones. Anyone found a light switch? What the hell? Translating. Pattern 1-3. Viability, 56.2%. Genetic template transmitted for testing. They were doing... things to the Ankara. 
Looks like they were running experiments of some kind. We have to save them. Get them out somehow. Jal, Pathfinder, they cannot be saved. What? I have analyzed the glyphs. These are not the Angara we know. They are not even alive. I don't understand. They look so... The remnant language refers to these bodies as genetic templates. A blueprint. Like the plants we saw. The Angara? We came from here? They created us? Why? Maybe they intended the Angara for some purpose that was never fulfilled. And what does that mean for the Angara? For me? This is big. Too big. The Mosha. We have to tell her about this. She'll know what to do. Meridian creates life. And the Archon could use it to do the opposite. Destroy everything. It's up to us to make sure that doesn't happen. If we crack Meridian's controls first, we make sure the Archon can't use it. So... It's working. The whole city's coming back to life. They were hiding a lab down there. Or were they hiding it? The whole city is coming to life, just like it's meant to be. Pathfinder, I am quickly building a workable data base of the remnant language. We have not encountered instances of it in such abundance before.
good sense of direction. I don't. Cat, how'd they get ahead of us? We did the work. They don't get to reap the benefits.
idea. But that looks like a gravity well. Pathfinder, the remnant language bears striking similarity to Angaran. That makes a lot of sense, actually. Translating. Connection lost. Meridian engine not found. Sam, is there damage here? Can we restore systems like we did before? I'm sorry, Pathfinder. Systems are intact, but they are searching for a component that doesn't appear to exist. What do you mean doesn't appear to exist? One moment, Pathfinder. I have found something. Translating. Final administrator log. The opposition's weapon may cause widespread damage. All our weapons, our ships, will not be able to protect us. Protect my goal. We need to disengage Meridian from Command Corps, which will remain here to draw fire. Meridian contains all the work of the Jardin. Nothing else matters. I will send it far. We can return one day. Continue the process of renewal. End of log. The Archon was wrong. This isn't Meridian. Meridian is gone. There must be some way to recall it. Get ready. We're getting out of here. Sam, find me another exit, away from the cat! There is no other exit, Pathfinder. However, the Remnant City is not without defenses, and this is its central command. Remnant defenses? Of course. Use them against the cat!
I knew those cat were trouble the minute I saw them. Ryder, you're not giving up on Meridian. If we all die, it won't matter. Everyone accounted for. We saw everything from orbit. It was incredible. The entire city lit up. The scans went wild. And Ryder? The Ket are retreating. Whatever you did, it worked. A full retreat? That's a relief to hear. Any progress on Meridian? Have you got it working yet? This isn't Meridian. Or at least not all of it. Hard to explain. We'll brief you later. So Meridian's gone. But shouldn't this thing know the nav point of where it went? Contact with the Scourge will have altered Meridian's original path. It would take countless years to determine its current location. All this remnant tech around us? The Jardin had to have a plan. Did they have time for a plan? Well, if the Scourge is messing things up, maybe that's where we should look. At what? I don't know yet. We'll have to think about it. Okay, no Meridian. But we kicked the Ket out of a major stronghold. That's huge. That just means we need to push forward before they can recover. We have to find Meridian. The real one. Sam, collect all the data you can. Radio the Tempest for extraction. This is going to take work. And it's going to take all of us. You seem well. We're all doing quite well here. Thank you. That is good to hear. This journey can't have been easy. Speaking of which, we know you defied us. You went for Meridian in direct violation of initiative orders, even though our reasons were quite clear. Yet, you were correct, Ryder. We should have trusted your instincts. You have proven time and again that you deserve the title of Pathfinder. 
I have never been so glad to be wrong. I appreciate your encouragement, and your candor. I am told there are still obstacles to reaching Meridian. The initiative stands ready to provide whatever support you need. Pathfinder, if you're done with your call to the Nexus, I'd like to talk to you. I think I've found a way for us to find Meridian. Pathfinder. Just the person I wanted to see. Meridian. Set on a path its creators. Disrupted by the Scourge. Now lost. An unmanned ship is at the mercy of ocean currents. Now, think of Meridian as the ship, and the Scourge as the ocean. If we can somehow predict the currents and track them, we could figure out where the ocean's taken the ship. That's genius. The Scourge is the sea, moving objects around. It's not a precise analogy, of course, but it illustrates the point. Dr. Anwar's suggestion may indeed be our best chance at finding Meridian. The more we know about the Scourge, the better we can predict how it affects the things it comes in contact with. We'll need better data. Probes for the Scourge and Garen star charts. The Initiative made charts of Helios from the Milky Way 600 years back. Perfect baseline. I can compare that to Helios at present. It'll give us numbers, but one set won't be enough. Sam, what exactly do we need right now? Readings from within the Scourge itself, collected by probes planted at key points. Once enough data is collected, we'll need initiative resources for mining and analysis. Once that is done, I can build a predictive model that will recalculate Meridian's path. We have a plan. Now let's make it work. Everyone's counting on us. Let's bring them home. <laughs>